Hi guys, welcome back to the automation point. So in this tutorial, we will see how to connect to a WS EC2 instance uh, with the Git Bash CLI on Windows machine. So let's move on the agenda. So here, first of all, what we will do, we will download and install the Git Bash. So we will use this URL, the same URL you can take from the um, descriptions of this video. Okay. Again, we, well, then we will move and we'll see how to create the key pair value that is the PEM file for any specific region and the region we are want to connect. Okay, and then once we have the level the P, uh, this key pair value, so we will using that key pair value we will connect to the uh, EC2 instance with a Git Bash CLI. So let's move ahead and let's see how to download this Git Bash. So let's. I have this git bash URL. So just take this URL guys and go here and you can type, just open the URL, enter. Okay. So yeah, so on the git bash URL, just go here. This is the, my system is the window. If you are using the Mac or Linux system, you can go in that, that specific section. Here I am going to click on the Windows one. And after clicking on the window, you can download this Git, uh, Git exe as per your your specifications of your system. So here, let's. I have already downloaded one, so I will pause it because uh, cancel it because it will take time. So whatever the downloaded exe I have, so I will use that exe to install uh, Git Bash on my system. So go there and here on the desktop inside the aws yeah so this gives git bash 64 bit uh, installer is here so just click on this installer okay and just we have to follow next next only so now i have clicked on the installer and here and um, just do the next again do the next no need to the program file always exists would you like to install the the folder anyway yes install do the next again do the next 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 install and this installation is happening so whatever the default option is coming just go with the default option just as uh, clicking on the next next so now the installation of the git bash is happening here so let's it get installed okay so yeah it is installing now it will take some time guys so just wait i think it will take the one one more one minute so if more than that time it will take then i will pause the video but it's taking i think it is about to finish okay Yeah, so now it has installed properly and it will give the pop-up that successfully it has installed. Yeah, let's do the finish. And once this Git Bash is successfully installed, just to go in any folder. So from any folder, if you do the right click, then you will get, uh, get the option Git GUI, GUI here and Git Bash here. Okay, so now Git Bash is on my this local Windows machine, and from that machine, I want to connect to the EC2 instance. Okay, so Git Bash is available here. Now we will show how to create key pair value. So to create the key pair value, just do the login to the your AWS EC2 AWS account and go on the EC2 dashboard. Okay so from this ec2 dashboard guys so inside the uh, go in the sec network and security and there is the option to a link and to create the key pair just uh, click on that and then create here the key pair and just give the name of that key pair let's say test four okay and create it so it's okay guys so this is created so what you need to do just copy this key pair and keep in any folder so already uh, what i have here 
so i i i am uh, just i have one ec2 instance running or up with this uh, key pair the key, second key pair the first or the key pair that run up key so with the, this instance let's see there this is the key pair. Pranab key pair is here for this instance. That is the running. So instead of the taking this uh, test for instance, uh, key pair value, I will use this already available key pair value. So just go on your local machine, okay, and to keep this key pair value inside any folder. And from that folder, where you can do the right click and open this git bash. Okay, if you will open this gateway from other folders outside this uh, uh, folder where this key pair is not available, then you will not be able to connect. So just take care of that, go inside, open the key pair, and from this folder, do the right click and open this git bash. Okay, CLI. Now git bash CLI is here, guys. Okay. No, then what we have to do, we have to do here to connect this machine, just select this one, click on the connect. Okay, after clicking on the connect, you will get this complete SSI, SSHI command. Okay, so just copy it from here. Okay guys, so just, okay, sorry. So it's taking in there, so just go here and copy it, okay. And now go to the CLI and in the CLI just right click it and paste it. And after pasting this um, command, just enter. After entering, thing uh, it's taking, yeah. After entering, this has connected. So sometimes it will ask for yes and no, but here it is have not asked for authentication. So already it has connected to the my EC2 instance. So the instance is name is the machine name is Ubuntu and its IP address is 17231. This one. So you can see this IP address here on this machine, whatever the machine you have selected here. So go there. And see the private IP address of this machine. So this machine private IP address is the this one. Okay, this one is the private IP address of this month uh, one seven two three one and uh, fifteen and eighteen. So now we have, we are connected to that uh, Ubuntu machine. So let's say if you want to run a command on that Ubuntu machine to list out the all the folder and files. So let's do ls dot dash l so all the file and folder of that uh, machine is available here so if you want to clean this entire console item just do the clear clear here enter so this entire thing has been cleaned from here so this is the what how uh, how to connect to the aws ec2 instance with the git best guys so in the last tutorial i we saw how to connect with the with, uh, ec2 instance using putty but uh, there we have converted the pam file into the what um, ppk file that private file but here what we are doing just we have come uh, to copied this one the uh, the, the u command sshi command with the this dns uh, and this spam file and we opened this what we have done we open this um, git bash cli from the folder where we have the, um, the pam file okay so this spam file is available from there we have opened this git bash and we have passed this command what command this entire command we have passed there and now and after that we are able to connect the git bash a specific ac2 machine so this is the what we have so now yeah guys so now we have connected to the ec2 instance and in this tutorial in the entire series of this aws begin beginner series tutorials guys i will be using most of time this uh, git bash only so because there is no need to convert here and uh, to the into the ppk file so it's easy to me so i will be uh, using this git bash uh, cli to connect to the any ec2 machine machine okay guys so yeah guys so i have covered this the uh, as end of this uh, tutorial so thank you guys please subscribe share and uh, like the uh, channels to keep getting automation updates guys thank you once again guys